lover one face of here welcome back to some more homebody i think i think hi puppy i think <laughs> we're gonna be beating it today i hope we're gonna be be beating it today uh because the game is getting long and some of the puzzles are getting frustrating as hell but it could be just because i'm an idiot um also i uh i changed jada's setup a little bit i got she so she has her own mattress that she's been using but for the past few months she's not been laying on squishy things which normally is her thing she she will find the squishiest thing to lay on but i think her arthritis is getting bad and she's been opting to lay on hard things like the floor um which is probably why she was laying behind me now uh for a while but what i did is I, I moved her mattress and then i just put like her her doggy bed on the ground and then just covered it with some blankets so she can make it how she wants and <laughs> she's already off her doggy bed bit so uh earlier she she messed it up though because it was all nice and flat and now it's all crooked because she's like nope i make it how i want but she can do that she can do whatever she wants how come oh it's just trick of the light it looks like um her, i thought her feet were um her her little pillow like the doggo pillow nope she just she's doing the sleepies um okay loud where i gotta remember <gasps> what we were doing oh this is interesting well i mean it looks like it's your look or, well i mean it looks like it's your lucky day huh we're here Is the roadhouse burned down guess so welcome back to town emily all right welcome back to town em emily why does it say bastard Hey, there's one of those little S things that we used to do back in the fucking 90s. I wasn't expecting Phil any arson on this trip, and I refused to become an accessory after the fact. Don't worry. I left a note saying you did it. <laughs> what happened here? According to, my, er, according to my phone, it burned down almost a year ago. The website said it was open. Oh, it's open, all right. I'm going to go climb on the hot dog. Me too. Uh, oh shit. Her voice is it. Do not get on the hot dog. Guys, I'm serious. Don't be idiots. I can't believe I dragged us all the way out here for this. Heat. Why are you just standing there, dude? You freak me out. Heat, you knew? Why didn't you tell us? I... Like, the game is really hard leaning into you thinking it's him, so I kind of want to believe it's not him, but it's... He's really creepy. Hmm. Her voice. God, somebody's gonna get hurt climbing on that hot dog. I just know it. Wait. What does a hot dog have bastard written on it? I don't know. I am a bastard. <laughs> You're not a bastard, Gary. Get off the hot dog. This is a weird turn. Not like anybody ever listens to me. Why should they start now? I think you just gotta let go of what you can't control, Francine. I think you liked me better when I was beneath you. What? Do I have multiple personalities? Or are these all just like different trains of thought? Did you hear all that, Megan? What did I mess up there? Well, Francine loves a plan. I know you and I don't care, but she does. I know. I just don't want her to be stressed out about it. I get that, but... Still, maybe not the first thing I would have said to my best friend who I haven't seen in a year. Well, I guess I really whipped that one. Nah, things are just changing around her faster than we can keep up with. Uh... Nesting... Oh, the knife. She said ye Oh, yeah. It's not like it's a bad thing, necessarily. The first time we did this, we didn't need to plan. Shit, it just happened. The only reason we ended up here was because we thought the giant hot dog was some kind of a tourist trap. Which it was. Decades before it became a gnarly karaoke joint. And then... And when they kicked us out at 2 a.m., us drunk idiots saw stars streaking across the sky. Amazing. It was pretty magical. The lightning doesn't strike twice, you know. Actually, I'm in town for a funeral. My grandma died. Oh, I'm sorry. No, really, it's okay. 
I don't really feel anything about it. I'm just rely relieved she's not suffering anymore. Watching her regress to the point that she thought all of us were dead people coming to get her was pretty devastating for my mom. Holy shit, that's scary. That can happen? Yeah, it's pretty par- It's pretty par for the course with Alzheimer's. Going back to an earlier time in their brain singing songs from their childhood. What's up, Yuri? Holy crap. Big buddy went bananas there for a minute. Yeah, cookie! Bananas cookie? Bananas cookie right here? I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Oh, get him a cookie. I take a photo cookie. Did I get rid of the Aya bobble? I did, did. That one hasn't been working for a while and I keep forgetting to check it out. Uh, there's also a delusion you can have where you think everyone in your life has been replaced with imposters. Crap grass disorder or something. That doesn't sound right. <laughs> well, that's horrible. Yep. Say, do you have any use for some melted plastic cutlery? That's very specific. Check it out. It's like a rat king of forks and the little plastic swords they stick cherries with. What a find! I gotta get a picture. Tori is gonna love this. What? Picture. Oh, God, he's standing in the background just staring at us. What are you doing here? Where's Pete? A good question. I never met your friend Pete. I've met, and I've met everyone here. I've seen him walking around, made eye contact with him, but there's nothing here. I don't think he's anyone. If Pete's not Pete, then who the hell are you? Also a good question. Har har. You realize this is a pretty stressful situation for me, right? I'm sorry. I feel a strange energy here myself. There's little I can do to help you now. It may be a small comfort, but if you have questions, I will do my best to shine a light in the dark. Can you talk normal? I'll try. Uh... What is the creature with the knife? Oh, we know it's a homunculus. Fuck! I don't know. I used to be oddly proud of it. I thought I created it. That was the only thing I've ever created. Now I'm afraid that might not even be true. I've got nothing to show for all this. My life. That's a house that's falling apart with dead people inside. Creepy. You would want that as a legacy? It's more than nothing. At least it would be proof that I was here. But I know that isn't true. Even if it was, what's the point? All a big mistake. Big coincidence. Small little man. Stupid. Uh huh. Uh, why can't I talk to the others? I mean, I can talk to them about pizza and video games and shit. Oh, wait. That was me. I can talk to them about pizza and video games and shit. Just not the time loop we're trapped in or the slasher movie villain that keeps killing us. I have no idea. When I approached you at the gas station, I found myself unable to speak in anything but poetry. Oh, that's why he was talking weird. I thought that was just how you always talk. And sometime later, I found myself able to express myself fully. Almost as if we had some gained some kind of understanding. Or maybe I just lost all respect for you. What happened with you and Clara? What, so what happened? She said that twice? Clara, I suppose you've had quite some time to explore. Sorry, not much else to do besides die. Well, I hope you enjoyed sifting through the detritus and foolish young man left behind as he stumbled backwards through life. I know I'm... I didn't... I never really... I wasted a lot of time. Now the time wastes me. Yeah, you do seem kind of... You do kind of seem like a hack. If you're here and I'm here, why isn't Clara? I've thought about that quite a bit. Between you, me, and your friend, I think we have a pro propensity for torturing ourselves. I don't think this place would have known what to do with Clara. There have been times where I so dearly wish I would find myself waking up her, waking up here again and she would be here too. A selfish desire. But I suppose without the selfishness, I wouldn't be here in the first place. One last thing. You really smoke weed with Hunter S. S. Thompson. He was in the vicinity. I see. What is that? What? M. Wentwin? You know I quit Cliff? 
But when? I thought you were here to burn one out with me like we used to. I can't just come over. I can't just come over here and enjoy your company. You can't enjoy his company, period. He sucks. No. So the owner, pro owner probably burned it down, right? For the insurance money? Guys, is Megan seeing someone? Holy crap, Jada. You're shaking everything. Oh, Tori? Yeah. Wow, never thought I would see the day. We've been engaged for like two years. What? Uh, Megan's voice. Hey, gang. What are you talking about? Oh, just how Emily doesn't sh know shit about her friends. Shut the hell up, Cliff. <laughs> hey, Cliff. Emily showed me this awesome melted cutlery rat king. Want to see it? Oh, yeah. That'll go great with my melted red plastic Italian restaurant, cu restaurant cup. See ya, Em. Later, Gear Bear. You think we could get sick from hanging around here? Like the burned rubble is putting stuff in our body that will kill us someday? When we're not expecting it? Holy crap, this is a long cutscene. Well, I spend every day expecting to drop dead of a mysterious and preventable illness. It'd be pretty funny if I contracted it from a fiberglass hot dog. <laughs> yeah, if I'm gonna die, it, it at least needs to be funny. I mean, my life's a joke already. He's a good punchline to make it all worth it. Gary, you're sounding a little too much like me. Are you alright? Sure. It's fine. My head kind of hurts. Behind my eyes. I'm gonna go look at the pile of menus and figure out what I would would have ordered. <laughs> oh, she left again. Where'd you go, puppy? There she is. That was the doggy. What are you looking at, Francie? You see the thing? At least nobody took a tumble from the hot dog, huh? Hey, Francine. I'm desperate to express even one thought of my own. I don't know what I'm trying to convey here. That has to be significant, right? Oh, right. Here we go. Are you mad at me? Er, yeah, I'm really sorry. Stop. I'm not doing this again. You're not sorry. You're scared of me. It can, I, it can be both. True. <laughs> I feel like you're waiting for a chance to tell me I'm wrong, and you're waiting for me to escalate to catch me in some mistakes so you can tell me so. Francine, I'm dying to fall on that sword. I'm dying for you to believe me when I tell you I know how wrong I am. This stuff doesn't work on axes of right and wrong. Emily. Oh. Oh. What the hell? I know you're sorry. You tell everyone that every chance you get, you need to do something. What am I sorry for? Besides me pissing her off earlier. I don't know why we're here right now. None of this makes any sense. I don't know why we're here right now. What do you want from me? Who gives a shit what I want from you? People aren't a fucking puzzle you can solve, Emily. I don't want you to die again. I can't take it anymore. I'm trying so hard to get us out of here. You're scary when you cuss. Jiminy, gosh. Oh, hey, Emily. Glad you could make it. Your room's down the hall. Is that better? Is that more like the weird retrograde 2D fantasy of me you're looking for? I've been caretaking and planning and organizing and protecting and trying to stop us from tearing ourselves apart, going through the motions for as long as I can remember. Now I am goddamn sick of it and I know you're hurting, but there's too much inertia for me to stop instead. Stop, so instead I'm here yelling at you about it. Uh... getting through to you I can I can tell I'm closer to getting through to you through to you than I can tell I'm closer to getting through to you than anyone else I know how this ends I've seen it happen over and over I'm done trying to change it and I refuse to take your stories about it and I know exactly how goddamn penny I'm being and I don't care because I've had an infinite number of nights to stew on this Oh, that's the thing we saw running. <laughs> Shh. 
she's oh are we all li living in our own little time loop let's move it in the background that was that little thing i saw running once oh what's the prism What? What just happened? I'm very confused. I don't know what's happening. Oh, there we go. I gotta make sure I could hear. Um, that's new. Umberton Possum learns a lot. It's a copy of the book I illustrated. This is a pile of cliff stuff. What's this doing here? Did stuff change? Cause that wasn't there. open this is new wait 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 could that be it that looks like a handle 420 blaze it this is what i packed i know i was in a hurry but this is two pairs of pants and no underwear what the hell this is so embarrassing Okay. Well, I guess that was worthless. I heard skittering. Oh, um, I was working on, uh, the, the water thing and we determined, I'm guessing that it needs to be 26. Can you walk properly? So we got to do all the water solutions to get it down to 26, right? Uh, I think this was it. That was it. Sick. Okay. So that stays. Ah, fucking there's spider webs everywhere. Is there something new here? No. Uh, and the next one is down here. Yes. This is 37. Oh, wait. I got the solution. Um Where is it? This one. Or tall, big, small. Okay. Making a little rhyme for myself. Or or tall small nice i wonder if that thing comes out even earlier now that i keep progressing it which freaking sucks i hope i don't have to go through the stupid gas thing anymore okay We've done that. Oh, wait, we don't know the solution for that yet. That's, that's the other one we need. Oh, shit. I didn't, I thought I was going to die. Oh, it warned me that I would die. Expect mainframe. And there's a note taped to the panel. Parker, to retrieve the instructions for the industrial pump, first rewind and then print. Okay. This is all you ever... This is all you ever use mainframe for, so I don't know why it's so hard to remember. And in case you forget, the calibration guide for the mainframe is in the study. Study? What's the study? 10, 9, 11? I'm in notes. Can't click anything. Inspect. Okay. What's this? Check machine. 
Ah, oh, shit. Another one of these. Oh, crap. Wait a minute. How do I get the other one, then? There we go. That do. That noise is freaking me out. What's this? Another of those things. That's not helpful. He's already out. I heard him kill someone. Sticky notes. The solution is in the study. I don't even remember where the study is. Cellar. Will any of these say study on it? Bathroom pump. Living room box left, living room box right. Cellar, attic. Steam tunnels. I don't think I've actually solved this still. The study? That must be where all the books are, right? These are linked. Why are those linked? Pumps are fine. Where's, um, the things I just got? At a door. How come I didn't get a memory for, um, Oh, this. That's the only one I got. I didn't get one for the computers. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, <gasps> these are the same. That's a sticky note. Look at. Oh, thank God those weren't next to me. I never would have. Th this this has to be the thing. Right? I never would have put this together if they weren't next to each other. Oh. 10, 10, 12, 9, 11. And these numbers are the same. Holy shit. No way. 10, 12, 9, 11. No way. I'm going to get killed. Okay. But I think, I think we have progress. Huh? 10, 12, 9, 11. Yeah. Whoa. Did you see the blood just show up? Oh, he must have killed someone. That's new. That blood is new. 10, 12, 9, 11. Oops. Oh, he's behind me. Don't come after me. I just need to check this out. Okay, he's close. Not that. Not that. This. 10. 12. 9. Oh, shit. He's coming. I figured out a thing. <gasps> Rewind print. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, dog. Computer symbols. Grind print. The fuck?
these paths. This looks like the um the arrow on this. No, it doesn't. That's just that's just the D-pad button. Damn it. Um. Rewind print. Okay. All right, he's close. I wonder if I can dodge him. I walk right into him. the hell was that noise oh i i re i saw one of my friends dead i think oh, just messaging me make me think someone was important you scared me bot um No tape to the panel. Uh huh. In case you forget the calibration, you got that. Rewind print. Retrieve the instructions. For Retrieve the instructions for the industrial pump. First rewind and then print. Print what? Print what? Huh. Oh shit. I died? That scared me. It scared me for sure. Okay, rewind print. Been a while, huh? You holding up okay? There's a lot going on in the flooded room, huh? big puzzle to solve in a room that's filling with electrical death water oh was the water filling up none of it means anything though if you don't know what you're trying to accomplish nest has gotten nest has got to have some instructions for the system on file somewhere bye for now that, that's smart of them to include him to give little hints and stuff okay uh maybe it's not worth doing this I think we'll solve it anyways because I think if we figure out how to do the pump it'll be worth it uh shit I already forgot the solution for this normal yep okay Fuck, who's breaking shit? Probably something happened in that room. Another little Easter egg or something. Okay. It's four. Yeah. Four tall. Big, small. Shit. Forgot to do the four. There we go. Hey, did you break something? Four tall, big, small. Gotta do the four. What's up, Josh? How you doing, dude? It's good to see you in chat. Missed you. Two, three, four, fall tall, big, small. A few of us are just seeing nothing on stream. Wait, what? Are you fucking with me? Are you fucking with me? Nothing on stream. 
Whoa! What the fuck? Ha OBS. Why? What the hell? Oh, snap. Yeah, it's all over. Okay, it looks like it's not just me. Oh, you see me now? Cool. Well, now I gotta go check another thing. God damn it. Um, that's freaking weird how you doing space josh thank you for letting me know by the way i appreciate you um i don't know if you can see me right now actually yeah maybe um maybe twitch was having some goofiness because i tried to load up some streams too and they all just had a, a black screen with the the loady bar Can this freaking work, please? There it goes. Can this freaking... There it goes. Okay. Oh, shit. I need that open. There it goes. There it goes. Oh, shit. I need that open. There we go. Okay. All good. All great. All dandy. Okay. Well, welcome in, everyone. Um, did I get the solution? Fuck! Fucked it up again. Uh, fine. All right, maybe I sh maybe I should have just tried to figure out the other solution. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I don't think Dixper's running either. Hold on. Yeah, because I had to kill it because it was locked up. What's up, George? What'd you end up doing for, uh, your bow? Good to see you too, Space. Haven't heard, uh, your little welcome sound in a bit. Although, I think you popped in the other day or so, right? So, I, I like good old... Something cowboy. Electric cowboy. They, they changed their name. Their old name is still in my brain sometimes, and I gotta... Gotta change it. All right, home body is there. Continue. All right, hopefully I clicked that button, right? Yeah. You're using the short bow for extra damage. Nice. Hey, there you go. Dixper's now set up. Uh, oops. There we go. Progress. Don't like that noise. Freaked me out. Ah. Okay. Um. Rewind and print. Rewind and print. Rewind and print. Oh, okay. I see how the water works now. I thought the whole thing was flood. I mean, it is. The fuck? Oh, that thing's changing over there. Oh. <gasps> Hold on. Where's that thing I found? There you go. Whoa. You, you need a triangle facing left, or like a complete triangle facing left and a partial triangle facing right. 
Oh, okay. Oh shit! Oh no! Look how close it is though! Look! That's the right way! It's just facing the wrong way! Can I spin it? Oh no, don't make me have to run back and forth between these rooms. Is this room is this room a spin? Okay, that one's actually simple. Oh, the guy's already out. I heard him murder someone. Okay, so this is modifying it. What? What? Okay, I don't understand this one. Oh. I'm assuming you have to do that, that dance every time. Now it's upside down. Fuck. Okay. This is annoying. Okay. Okay. I think we're on to something. What's that going to do? No, it's backwards. Okay. Oops. Come on. Things gonna come stab me. No. Oh, this doesn't work the way I thought it would. Puzzle sucks. Huh. Fucking. Is it the same time every time? I should pay attention to that. Need to get another brain for this fight. Get shoved off the edge? Yeah, that. Once that happens to you enough times, then you're like, all right, that this is the ideal way to take people out. Love shoving people off edges. Doing the shadow pill fight, and it's going horrendously. I don't remember the shadow pill fight. There, there's a bunch of shadow pill fights, actually, now I think about it. Tall, big, small. Get myself as much as possible in that stinking room because it sucks. Sorry, it's hard to keep up on chat when I'm on like a time limit. Okay, I took the long way. It's fine. I don't understand this puzzle. A 
Neat. That might be it. Because the arrow was facing the other way before. Click. Yo, ya boy. Yo, sick. I think I did a thing. Uh, it's a down arrow. Okay. Oh shit, that door's locked. Uh. What if I point down? Oh, I gotta switch power. Okay. I think I figured it out. You just gotta flip it. I hope this works. Okay. Fuck. Okay, maybe not. Switch it, switch it, switch it. Hey, figuring things out. Is that right? It looks kind of off. But the screen shows it right. I did a thing. Oh, notes. Not that. Notes. Read printout. Yo! Progress! The printout reads 62 PSI beneath that a note. The industrial pump uses all of the remaining fluid in the hydraulic tank, so be sure the fluid levels in the tank are correct before operating. Right, so that tells me I need to fill up the other tanks. Is the guy out? Is he stabbing people yet? Oh man, this is a pain in the ass. I'm gonna have to solve that every time. I'm gonna end up walking right into him. Oops. Ah! Hold you. Oh, you got a fucked up face now. Ew, I hate. I hate. Four different times you got yeeted off the edge? Yeah. The game uh, learns you pretty good. Stay off the... Stay away from those ledges, huh? Sometimes you even think you're safe, and then they're like, Oh my god, they were able to shove me so far. Hey, take care of yourself if you can. Fuck! Okay. Okay. I think we have progress. So let's go take care of this one first. Go in, click. One, two, go. I hope I don't have to sit there and watch it. Sick! I do not. One, two, three, four, four, big. There we go. Go. Hurry up. Let me in. Let me in. There we go. Okay. So, oh, so I don't need to solve that fucking puzzle anymore. Because I already know the solution. Or I know the PSI. Fuck yeah, dude. Oh, I thought I was going to have to do it all over again. Uh, 62. Okay, pause. I have 18 droplets. 
actually. Can I do this? Where's the other pump? Oh, it doesn't show up until I've solved it. Shit. Okay. So I got a tall one. Three fat ones. I got two tall ones. Okay. And I need to be 62. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So that would be 15. It'd be 35. Hmm. Okay, so it would be 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So I, I can get 10. It's 50. Eleven is fifty five. Twelve. Six. Fifty seven. Fifty eight. Fifty nine. Sixty. Sixty one. Sixty two. So twelve. Huh? Wait a minute. How do I? Seven. Okay, let's do this. I think. Yo, first try. Let's fucking go. What the hell? That's like gamer. Oh, here you go. Look at the silly chicken. The coin in me. Sandwiches. I hate it. Josh root. Oh, that's the generator. Turning this thing on adds a unit of power for the accumulator. Turn on the generator in the mall. Kind of freaky being here in this mall again. Kind of freaky that this mall exists under the ruler house in Pennsylvania. Does this one have a secret? Look at the silly chicken. Not doing anything. Oh, was there no shortcut? Fuck. How do I get to the other ones? I think I remember. Oh shit, I have to go to the attic. Shit, I'm not gonna make it. How do I get to the attic? Oh crap. This fucking puzzle. I'm not gonna make it. Let's just verify that this is the right way. This is the wrong way. Where do I go? I had it. Oh, shit. It was downstairs. Okay, at least two of them are down here. And the other one's all the way up. Okay, okay. okay. I think we're on to something. 
we're gonna start hearing murders here soon. Seven three three. Here we go. Uh, this one. No. This one. Yeah. Oh shit, I don't remember this one. Two seven eight? Is that it? Two seven eight. No, this is the one I wrote down. Nine oh nine. Yes. Don't know why that one doesn't save. Let me go. We got two of them. I don't remember what. Oh, that's cool. I don't remember what time. Um. Okay, nine fifteen. Can I get through here? Oh, right. Never mind. Okay. So I need to. I need to do the lightning rod first. I don't remember how to do it. Okay, so we got to go get stabbed. We hear him. What if I just go try to do the... Oh, I can't do the lightning rod because I didn't finish the puzzle. Where you at, sucker? All your clothes are off now. Gross. Okay, so we got to do the attic first. Speed run time. This, 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 this. Was there no shortcut to that one? Because that sucks. That means I have to solve all this shit at once. Oh, shit. That's new. Is this the Pyramid Francine through? What is this doing here? Is that blood? I hope Francine is okay. Is Francine the murderer? That's creepy. Ah, fuck. I forgot. I forgot the steps this requires. Okay, well, since we're up here. Oh, well, I thought I was... I switched the, my USB cables and stuff out trying to fix my input lag. Doesn't seem like it fixed it, so that's cool. All right, let's knock that out. What's up, dudes? Oh, God damn it. Something broke upstairs again. Maybe I should go check that out because it's the second time. Heard that. I remember to flip that stupid switch. Oops. Look at all this time I'm wasting. This sucks. This. This. That. There we go. I'm not gonna make it. I need a slow time ability. Did you talk to me? Oh, it's open, right. I heard the thing break again. What is that? Oh, it's gonna be close. Dink, 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 dink. Come on. I don't remember the solution for this one. We're gonna have to look it up. At least pull it down. Okay, what was it? Lightning rod. 8712. Something keeps breaking. 8 0 oh, 7 1 
too. Okay. I go downstairs. The thing's gonna come out soon. Trying to speed run. Scared. Seven three three. Seven three three. Come on. It's coming out. Uh, it was seven. Seven fat. coming out hurry up oh man i can feel my heart pounding shit he's out go 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 the lightning strike is a coming Please don't. Okay, the lightning strike. <gasps> Fuck you, man. That was dirty mean. I didn't even hear him. Maybe you can't hear him anymore because his mask is off. That sucks. I hear me. Jeez, things are tough, aren't they? They accumulate these three power sources and you've gotten them all individually. Now you just need to get them all in one loop. You're almost there. Just the lightning rod, the model generator, and the atrium generator. One go. But remember, you've got to activate the lightning rod before the lightning strikes. See you later. Yeah, I figured that out. But the asshole had to be there. Okay, let's do this again. Alright, trying to knock it all up, out at once here. So we go. Ding, ding, ding. Turn on. Come on. I suppose we can knock this one out immediately, right? 733. Three. This is the wrong one. Fuck. God damn it. to go move your legs move your legs i wonder if i need the the garage door open at some point all right i gotta get there quickly shit he's gonna be coming out soon fuck you have to be like perfect dude that's rude so we switch, 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 and then switch, 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 switch. Fucked it up. Fuck, I'm not gonna make it. Fuck. This sucks. Open the door. Dink, 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 dink. I'm not going to make it before he comes out. All right, 
right, which one is it? Forgot again. Uh, lightning rod. 8712. Go, 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 go. He coming, he coming, he coming. <sighs> oh shit, I gotta do this. Open the fucking door! Oh man, I'm freaking out. Oh shit, I forgot the solution. It's it's four. It is four, okay. Four tall, big, small. One, two, three, four. Switch. Go. He's coming, he's coming. Hurry up, hurry up. I'm freaking out, dudes. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Switch. Go. Oh no, he's out. No. Everything's powered up. Oh, I have to go all the way fucking back up to the top. That sucks ass. Oh, this is gonna be frustrating as fuck. I have nowhere to hide. Please don't be here. Panicking. No! Oh, come on. Man, is this... <sighs> this is gonna suck ass. Really? <sighs> this is where it's gonna get frustrating. I'm trying to think if I could do that any faster because that sucks that I have to go to the basement to unlock the thing to unlock the attic go all the way back up to the attic or come up to the main level to unlock the attic go all the way back up to the attic to enable the lightning rod to go all the way back down to the basement to en enable both the generators to go back up to the attic again you turn on the actuator. I wonder if I can knock out those two generators before nine. I'm going to try to do that. Lightning strikes at 9.15, right? Okay, so if I do this, 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 turn this on. Also, I can do a test here. 7.33, three, three. open that, go this way, go this way, go in here, run through here. Don't like that. Josh trying to scare me. 
9009. First generator. What, what are we playing? DVD? First gen. Okay. Run out. Run out. Run out. Let's see if this will actually open. It's four, all big, small. Right? Still works perfect. That was a scary noise. Didn't like that. Uh, switch, 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 switch. Okay. Ah. One, two, go. I like the noises I'm hearing freaking me out. It's eight, seven, one, two, right? I'm going to check so I don't fuck it up. Freaking me out, dude. Yeah, I've done that. Um, where's the thing? There it is, lightning rod. Eight seven one two. Yes, I know. He's coming out soon. We gotta go. I'm gonna go this way so this door is open. Oh my god, it's so far to run. Oh. I think it's impossible to do it without him coming out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Flip, go. pop it before he comes out sweet so he doesn't know where i'm at hit that lag don't fuck with me okay, we just heard him oh my god he's murdering everyone God, my butthole puckered. I could have made a diamond if you shoved pencil at my ass. Oh. He's chasing me? No. He shouldn't know where I'm at. No input lag. Fuck. Yo! Oh, what are you doing up here? That was creepy. Emily. Francine! I didn't mean to scare you. What are you doing up here? Yeah, what are you doing up here? Why is it all laggy and creepy? The lamp in the study broke again. I knew you were up here. Oh. 
What? Okay, the music is creepy. 55,000 channel points. Oh, great. Gonna be scaring me all the time. If you have any Dixper things from uh, last year, they're all enabled again, too, so. Oh, my heart. I can feel it. We need to talk before you do something rash, Em. There are other things we can we, we can do. Other options. I mean, for God's sake, Emily, look at that thing. Do you really think I, I can solve all your problems? It's a way out of here, I think. What other choice do we have? Do you think you know how to get us out of here? Out of this? Okay, so she's aware of it too. Why does it feel all laggy? And that was really loud. And what's with the creepy music box playing? No, Em, I'm telling you, neither of us do. Maybe there is no way out. That's terrible. I think I first clocked it when you started poking around and solving Nest's little puzzles and talking in code. And for a moment there, I had a glimmer of hope that this was progress for the both of us. That maybe you would help me figure out how to get us out of here. But nope, you're still you. What? Why does she hate me? I don't understand. But I'm begging you, don't let it come to this. Why trust a weird old man and his weird machine? It's something. What other... What idea do you have? Uh, if you have any other idea, present it. And we can try it. Because what the fuck? Listen, I don't want this... I don't want this fight to end. I want this to stay ugly because it's something. Wait, what? But we need to get out of here, Francine. One way or another. We don't know what it'll do. It could ruin everything. As if everything wasn't already ruined enough. What... I don't understand her reasoning. This could be the end, Emily. Ah! <sighs> Shit, watch out. That hurt my neck. That hurt my neck a lot. Francine, I'm sorry. Pull the lever, crunk! Accumulator power up and activate the accumulator. Did I win? Are we done? Oh, do I have to walk out the door? No, wait, he showed up. Why are you here, creep man? Another fine mess you've gotten yourself into. What the hell? He could be pretentious sometimes, but he didn't talk like a goddamn great gazoo. Who's great gazoo? That's made it sound like you're not really you. Is the weird laggy intentional? Because it hasn't done that until today. And you're going to trust him? You took the time to turn on his machine. Look how much good that did you. Seems, seems like it worked out okay. I'm still here. That's all I was going to say. Barely. You can't keep coming back like this forever. Turning on the accumulator almost bled this place dry. What place is this? This, this is like a nightmare purgatory, dude. And the... I thought the accumulator created this place. The accumulator couldn't create shit. It's a wooden box attached to one of those static electricity machines from the science museum. At least it was. The decades of obsession has put into it turned it into a ticking time bomb. The raw energy of it almost killed this place. What place is this? So if this place dies, what happens to us? Do we get set free or what? How do you define free? Don't start with me. Truthfully, I don't know. The strength that's keeping you here is giving out. But so is the strength that's keeping here here. When that strength is finally gone, I don't know if you'll no longer... I don't know if you're no longer here or if you go out with the rest of what's here. If that makes sense. It does not. It makes about as much sense as any of the rest of this stuff. I don't think I'm going to be able to talk to you again after this. I don't think I'll be able to do anything after this. Since there's just... They'll be... It'll be a quiet moment before the thought of the house intrudes again. Do you have anything you'd like to know? The house intrudes. Who are you, really? For all intents and purposes, I'm Pete. That doesn't help. What's that thing? It's a symptom. Side effect. So are you... So are you, though you have little more of a sense of self than the homunculus does. Are you helping me? Like I said before, why do you think I Why do you think I would want to hurt you? Because you've had me 
and my friends trapped in a hellish memory with a meat monster that keeps killing us. I didn't create the house. I didn't create you or the memory or the meat monster. Things just flow through me. I don't, want any, I don't want any of this for you. I don't want anything. If you didn't create the killer, who did? I didn't know. Entropy? What is up with all these evasive answers? I can't believe Ness was more forthcoming than you. Ness just has a way with words, I guess. What happens to you now? I don't know. That one's a little beyond me. There's a threshold I'm aware of. I can hear it. I can barely hear anything else. I'm really scared. I'm really scared. I'm not ready to cross it. But I don't have any choice. Still, it was good while it lasted. It was nice meeting you. Shucks. All right. I feel like I'm starting to fade. I don't have the choice. I don't have the choice not to bring the house back again. The house, all of you, at night. The gravity of it is too great. Greater than me. Why? I don't know. Seems pretty pointless if you ask me. It's been created and destroyed and recreated before. But this time, it's taking longer. I don't know how many more times it can happen again. I have no idea what's happening. Take care. I am so completely lost. Oh, the house is being rebuilt. Oh, and it's making me be in it. Oh, it's not over. It's not over. Don't be the meat monster. Oh, are you hurt? <gasps> are you hurt because of what happened last time? Hey. Hey. Oh, nope. Not the house. What happened? I'm, um... I'm about to head out of town, and I didn't want to leave without... Without checking on me? Did we get in a fight? Like, I hit her? Yeah. Do you want to come in? Is that my girlfriend slash ex? They said she was my best friend. How's your head? Oh, it's fine. I didn't even end up spending the night. When I got home, I passed out, like, immediately. I can't waking up. Something about being told you could die in your sleep really gives you fitful dreams, you know? Yeah, did you get a concussion? You're not supposed to go to sleep if you have a concussion. Anyway, the doctor said I could sleep. So I've been working at it all day. I've got my sleepy time tea. Should be fine. She just said to avoid caffeine in, like, Strenuous mental activity, I guess. Gosh, Francine. I just wanted to say that I'm... Um... Hold on. Are you here to apologize? You feel sorry? Or what? I don't know. I... I guess just watching you falling, I couldn't help but think I could have done something about it. About what? Fiberglass hot dog collapsed. I got a concussion. That fuck... That hot dog? It wasn't the end of the world. I really thought that hot dog could hold our weight. I did too. You could have broken your neck. Oh. Is she blaming herself? Is that... And... Her anxiety makes her just relive that moment over and over again. You could have broken your neck. But I didn't. You came with me to the ER. You were there for like three hours. People have aneurysms. Sometimes hours later. People hook their heads going up the stairs and die after a week with no warning. I remember you having a better handle on this stuff. What's going on? I think I might be experiencing some cognitive decline. What are you talking about? Alzheimer's? I don't know. I'm just... I, th I think I'm just in town to see some fucking shooting stars or whatever, a meteor shower, and I'm stuck in this part of the process where my friends and I are like strangers. The ice never breaks. I can't get through to anyone. The mass freak shows up, starts killing them. We're stuck in a time loop and keep living the same night over and over. And we find out the house we're trapped in is all made of meat. Ew, the house is made of meat? Oh, that could be a symbolism, though. Trapped in a house made of meat? That's your own brain. 
possibly. I could be looking too much into it, but that that makes sense to me. Uh, we're stuck in a time loop. Same night where everything sucks, even before a masked murder monster comes and kills us. It's so abs oh wait, it's so absurd that I start to think it must not be happening. I assume it just has to end somehow that it was never real in the first place. But no, there is a mass killer and it's some kind of Groundhog Day thing. But even that isn't true. It's some kind of nasty fake reality we're in. I don't know. And I'm like, is there some just something fucked up about me? <gasps> Did I do something to deserve this? Like I created that thing, didn't I? Build it into being? What? Or is this just in my head? Am I unconscious in a car at the bottom of the ravine? Did I slip in the fucking shower or something? Emily, you can't... The worst thing about all this is I don't even know if anything is special about it. Maybe this is just a normal delusionment. Emily, we're trapped in a time loop, and there's a knife-wielding monster that keeps killing us. Ugh, I know. It sucks. But something about this night, when I leave, when I left your apartment, whenever, whenever the hell this actually happened... I remember the look you were giving me. Like, future uncertain, anything can happen stuff. And I fucked it up. Permitted myself away and didn't talk to you or anyone. I let it all slip. I lost my best friend over nothing. After the night at the hospital, I told myself I wasn't going to depend on anyone else ever again. I wasn't going to caretake or be taken care of. I went all in. All in on me. And when I saw you again at the nest house a year later, I realized it was working. I guess. I wasn't angry, didn't feel passionate about not having heard from you. It was just a matter of fact. Oh, Francine, you don't have to apologize. I was going to say, I don't think she is. I'm not apologizing. I did what was right for me. I decided I wasn't going to give you or my dad or my landlord who needs to come inside my apartment for a half hour to tell me he's raising my rent. I decided I wasn't going to give anything more time or thought that I could spare. I did everything I could. I started waking up at 6 a.m. every day, meditating for an hour. I upped my therapy as many times a week as my insurance would allow. Then when I lost that insurance, I found free counseling services and did that as much as I could. Good for you. I made a full-time job of just trying to be happy, and I'm still not. It wasn't enough to maintain. The yearning's still there. There's a sense that whatever used to make life magical is gone now. You can't remember what it was, so you invent things. It was a video game you loved, the Halloween bucket from McDonald's. Remember those Halloween buckets from McDonald's? There was a pumpkin one, there was a ghost, I think there was a ghost one, and there was a Frankenstein one. Or maybe it's a plan you make some future time where you, you imagine you'll feel exactly like you used to. The reality is, things are changing, but no, nothing is changing faster than you are. The days are shorter now, and you're in pain, and there's somebody with a knife coming for you. Don't hit your head on the stairs. I'm so goddamn sick of living in the past. That sounds pretty healthy. And why does it hurt so much? Not everything feels good all the time. So, we're not really here, are we? Oh my god, it's gonna, like, lightning flash be back to the house. I don't think so. I think the house trip was probably a long time ago. All the flashbacks we've been having are all part of the illusion, too. Wherever we are, we gotta figure out how to get out. One of these two flashbacks, yeah. They've, they've all been just a little off, you know? Right. The abstract landscapes and the pink flesh monsters and the meat world can't all be memory distortion. It feels good to be able to talk about it. It does. Oh, I hate that. You. Shit. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god, are you okay? Oh my god, she's going to turn into it. Nah. Nah, that's fine. I'll get a towel. No, 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 we need to leave. She's, oh, okay. Oh. Why is that plant dancing? Ow. Yeah, ow. Uh -huh. Are we going to do, like, the crazy people person last? Josh, thank you so much for contributing, my dude. I appreciate you. I guess it's kind of pathetic that we weren't able to let... Any of this go, huh? Spooky scared of skeletons and shivers down your spine. Oh my god, this scared of shit. Each call will shock your soul and seal your doom tonight. DJ, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Pupper Pile. Get a cookie for you. Get a cookie for you. Hey. 
Good morning on this cookie. Oh, big yawning. Cookie. Cookie dead cookie. Snip, snip. Snip, snip. Uh. Yeah, I wonder when this even actually is. The present, I mean. It's sad if there's nothing happening. There's ha Whoa. Start over. It's sad if this is happening like a year after the trip to Ness House. We sad if it's like five years later. Or if it's been decades and this, and this is hell. Pretty boring hell. And we're gonna die in this place, aren't we? Probably. I mean, permanently, for real this time. Oh, our, the blood pools are growing. Ah, shit, that's, that's the house. I know that light and the clock, okay. Fuck. It's not over! It's not over. What could there possibly be? I have no idea what there could be left. There's blood on this. That poster's gone. Oh shit, things are changing in the house that, that um... What's it called? That picture was on the ground. That's different. A bunch of little rectangles labeled names of rooms throughout the house. Attic. Flooded room. I've definitely seen this before. Anything else different? Oh, this. Oh, that's her. Never mind. Oh my god. Is that a bug? Wait. Oh! Everyone's missing their face. Oh, I hate that. Okay. Okay, all the food's rotten. Expect nasty muck that looks like it used to be eggplant farm. It's buzzing with flies. Okay, maybe we need to observe the house. I don't know when that thing's gonna come out though, which is a problem. Okay, let's let's look for things that are just different. Change this real quick. Oops. Nice. Oh, that was perfect. He's out already? Fuck off. No. I haven't I haven't even got the chance to fucking look at shit. Ew. Okay. I hate that. They're everywhere now. Did you steal my friend's faces? Alright, he's gonna come kill me. I'm gonna run upstairs real quick. Thing different dead friend newspaper article frankenstein switch manuscript dracula drawers he is through the wall 
door. Yeah. Okay. Okay, maybe not that much that actually has changed. Computer, pamphlet, manuscript, post-it note, machine, schedule. Never figured that out. All right, go get murdered. Should be right out here. We heard him. Wait, where are you? We heard you. Where are you? Where you at? There you are. I have like no time to observe anything. What do we have? Oh, okay. So the circles were like exits, right? So this one didn't work. This one didn't work. Suitcase rooms clue. Not attached to anything. Let's go check the accumulator. I don't know if I'll be able to get up there in time. He came out really early. I guess Francine opened this up already. Huge. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. That's not. Oh, shit. Stare at void. What's going on up here? That thing that's been growing in the sky. It's not the moon. It's some kind of hole. I was hoping we'd just turn on the accumulator again in this place. I need to talk to Francine about this. Oh, shit. Oh. Fucking where's Francine? Oh. She still has a face. Francine. Hey, Emily. You better not come out. Oh, I'm talking to someone. So, we're back. Yeah. I was kind of hoping we just, like... Wake up in our bed somewhere. Free from this. Same, but hey, we're not dead. Guess we have to figure out how to get out of here for good. Let's try. By the way, I'm sorry about the business in the attic. The fight over the accumulator. Francine, you... You know you don't have to apologize. I mean, I didn't know what was going. What I was doing, the thing could have killed us. Yeah, well, it didn't. And at the end of the day, what other options do we have? Sure. Pete, whoever Pete, or yeah, Pete, whoever Pete is, you were talking to Pete too, right? Yeah, at least it looked like Pete. But I don't know. It's like he busted, he's busted or something. He used to be a little more him. Since she showed up, he's gotten fuzzier. Anyway. Oh, wait. Is that me talking? Whoops. Anyway, Pete said that turning on the accumulator at full power almost killed this place, so I guess I had the right idea. The bandit's gone now, sucked into the void or whatever. You saw that, huh? The attic? Yeah. What the hell is going on up there? I think that the full moon that's been above us this whole time is actually some kind of void. Where's the little glass thing that you had? And it's getting bigger as this place 
dies. Crap. What are we gonna do? Do you think this is gonna do the lights? Oh. That looks like the dash is above the elevator. The elevator? All oh, right, the one that the killer rides up into the house. Is that the one? So the one with the lines that we saw that's by the, that in the area where the gas rooms are, I guess it makes sense, is attached to that room that's right outside where he's freaking out. Where he, where he walks in with the painting with the missing eyes. Anyway, that thing, that the creature, the killer. Wait, what do we call that thing? Armunculus. I don't know, Zippy? I said it was a homunculus. Sure, a false human. But isn't that kind of a mouthful? Don't we want to be precise? I think there are more important things to worry about. I guess we could shorten it. <laughs> there are more important things. Fair enough. Yeah, it brings a homunculus up to that crawl space next to the bedroom on the second floor. But it's impossible to get inside up there. Right, and it passes through the little wall. Little waiting room next to the cellar at some point during every loop. Wait, what? It passes through the little waiting room. Next to the cellar at some point. Is the waiting room where... Where's the... I don't know the names of these rooms. Is the waiting room the, uh, the room with the elevator? Yeah, and where the hell does it start? It's like someplace far beneath the house. Why would the killer be on the elevator in the first place? Ness told me about it once. Well, he didn't actually know either, but he said that he figured out how to get inside. Hey, how? Tell me. He said it had something to do with the waiting room. Some hidden sequence there. He said that he got it open himself once, but that he was too afraid to go inside. He thought it could end this whole thing. That it could solve the mystery of the loop. If not escape it outright, but he said he was far too much of a coward to do it himself. Wait, so there we're, we are, we're all living in a loop, but we're the only two aware or that can talk to each other. Is that what's happening? At least he was uh, being honest, I guess. Yep. Either way, it seemed important. Like the homunculus was coming from there for a reason. Do we need to ride? Oh, so we need to ride down, ride down that elevator ourselves? I guess so. I guess so. Oh, I guess that must have something to do with the clue in my suitcase. Have you seen the other kids? So what's... So there's a giant boy in the sky that's slowly eating this place. Have you seen the other kids? Oh god, yeah. With the hole in their faces? I hate it. One night, all of a sudden, they were just... Gone. Here, but checked out. I saw the same thing happen to Laura once. We were talking, and I think I pushed her too far. And then... Oof, she was gone. You're lucky you get here late. I'm here alone with them for like a whole day. Oh man, I keep forgetting you You get here before me. That sounds horrible. For a while, it was kind of nice. It was good seeing them at their high point. Over time, the longer we were stuck in this place, a Paul, Paul kind of fell over the whole thing. A Paul? I, I've never heard that term. I hated seeing them get down on themselves. Now it's kind of peaceful, if in a creepy and unsettling kind of way. They're quiet. They're like this the whole time before I show up? Yeah. For me, the loop starts on Friday night as soon as I step in the door. The other kids are here too, unpacking their things. Holy shit. How they just stare at each other, going through the motions like they're chatting and having a good time. But they're not. Holy crap. It sounds like it was far worse for Ness. One time he... One time he told me he was alone in the loop for what felt like years, waiting for us to show up. Oh my god. <laughs> the... The killer's kindly just been waiting there this whole time. No wonder he seems so exhausted. I hope he's okay now. Good way, I guess. So there's a giant boy in the sky that's slowly eating this place. Yes, and when you put it that way, it does seem really bad. I don't know why I'm trying to put a on a brave face. It's really horrifying. I keep trying to be brave about it too. 
kind of hard to be light-hearted in a situation like this, though. Keep made it sound like this place, uh, the version of the house that we're in, even the places from the past that we've seen lately, they're all part of some greater being. Living being? Oh, that's one that's dying? Yeah. And as it, and as it dies, the hole in the sky is going to get bigger and bigger. Until there's nothing left. And seeing this is so fucked up, I hate it. I'm going to try to figure this out. Let me know when, what you find. Alright, the thing's coming. Oh! You scared me. The hole in your face. Okay, let's go... ...to the... ...elevator door. Did I open that? Or was it already open? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. What are these arrows. The arrows, the path he takes? What are the arrows? I am at a loss. I have no connections to this thing. This one I never... I don't know if there was supposed to be a connection here. Those are floating. Jenny's Borkin. Jenny's Borkin. Oh. There. There you go. Here's a Borkin doggy. I have no idea. Blades of Grace Senior Living. First Corinthians five fifty or fifteen fifty three fifty five. That's probably love is patient, love is kind. I be, yeah, I think that's the love is patient, love is kind. Relatively short lips and names. Fuck. I don't understand this. So I'm in the waiting room.
waiting room has an up arrow. We're in the foyer that doesn't have an arrow. I see no pattern between the arrows. What are the arrows? Hey chat. Any idea what the arrows are? I have I I thought like it would be pathing for the monster. But it doesn't make sense cuz the bathroom one points up and you you only can go that way to get into it. At least it's separated by floor. Because attic is by itself. And you got second floor. Wait. Yeah. And then, yeah. And then the main floor. The cellar. And then, yeah. Okay. So at least they're separated that way. Those are squares. Squares are lit up. Some of them. Squares are lit up. Where am I? I'm in the foyer. Idea. I hate that. I hate that idea. These could be related to like the light switches. here was on I turned it off oh sick that's just open I thought I opened it last time it's the middle one no way Confirm this theory. Input lag, stop. He's out already. That is here. Kill. Oops. Ugh. I don't like moving in the dark. Okay, it's on now. No fucking way. Okay. 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 So it's related to the light switches. I don't know what the arrows mean. I hate it, Josh. 
Okay, so the cellar needs to be off. The waiting room needs to be off. Art studio? Is that the art studio? Oh my god, is it gonna make me do that? Wait, this way. Go. Oh. Is this an is this the art studio? Where's the light? Where's the switch? There it is. I hear it. He's above me. Input lag. Stop. Stop. All right. Let me see if there's something bothering my computer. Steam. Voice mod, snap cam. No? Nothing, nothing. Okay. Um. Well, hopefully it doesn't fuck me over in a time of need. Uh. So the cellar needs to be off as well. And the flooded room needs to be on. Where is the light for this place? There it is. I'm gonna get jump scared because it's so freaking dark. No! Oh, I still have to solve this puzzle. That's a bummer. That's a bummer. That's a big bummer. Let me in! Let me in! Flooded room. Is this the flooded room? That's not the flooded room. I didn't mean to do that. I thought it was the other door. It's fine. Is it gonna come down here? I hear footsteps. I can't look well in here. Maybe not? Oh, there it is. Turn it off. What was that haze? Okay, so I got these done. Oh shit, there's a garage. Oh. Oh, I was like, why isn't there one here? I don't have to go into the... I don't have to go behind the garage. I don't think. Garage needs to be on. Oh shit. Do I have to... Do I have to do this while the power is on? Or does the power stay on because we activated the actuator? You know what I mean?
Garage on, kitchen off. Okay. Fuck you, lightning. Ugh, excuse me, that made me burp. Scared me. Still killing people out there. Ugh, excuse me. killing people oh fuck you that was bullshit how how are you there and you were killing people right there i don't understand okay oh you're off click the fucking oh my god the switch Let's actually, you know what? Let's take, uh, take care of the attic first. It's open, right? Go, 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 go. Uh, this is the study. On, okay. This is the. Both the bedrooms need to be off. Input lag! Stop it! Come on, dude. Open. Attic needs to be on. It scares me every time. Oh, dude, the input lag is terrible right now. He's gonna walk out right in front of my face, isn't he? needs to be on it is on okay i think we're done here move all right living room on dining room on kitchen off garage on living room on Dining room on, right? Living room on, dining room on. Kitchen off, garage on. Kitchen off, garage. On, shit. Come on. Don't see me. Cellar off, waiting room off, art studio on. Cellar off. Four. Shit. It is four, right? Yes. Oh, fuck you, dude. freaking out oh fuck you how oh maybe because there's a hole in that door god damn it uh, that was annoying all right both bedrooms off study on bathroom on Room off. Oh shit, that was a study. Fuck. No. 
This thing. Just wasted time. Me out. Whoa, that was a weird way to open a door. Turn off light. Uh, attic on, right? Attic on. You open the fucking door! And the bathroom was already on, if I remember right. Although I'm gonna kick myself if I don't check. Or if I didn't check properly. Or if it's gonna be the thing. Alright, turn this off. Turn it off! Oh my god! Flip it! God damn! This one's on. Oh, this one was off. That thing is misleading. No, it's not. Open the door. Kitchen off. What's the garage? On. Garage. Flip the switch, goddammit. Cellar's off, right? Cellar off, waiting room off, art studio on. Cellar off. Let's do this. I wonder if that activates him to come down here. Waiting room. Off. There it is. Studio on. Art studio. Oh, fuck you. Where is it? Don't be here, don't be here. I will scream. All right, flooded room. Needs to be on. No, fuck, wrong one. Open this door, go in here. Wait, fuck, it's already on. I would have been done. Don't be here. Don't be here. Don't be here. Don't be here. Inspect. No fucking way. Get in there. Input lag. Don't fuck me. What? Push it twice, it's so fucking unfair. Uh descend the bird cage out. No 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 no. Where am I supposed to go? Twelve AM is blinking. Does it have to do with those? What the fuck? Oh, this is new. Notes to myself. Please don't kill me. Examine package. Package from Francine. She sent it like the week after I moved. I kept meaning to open it. I'm hearing things kill stuff. Oh, fuck no. It's new! Oh. This is Laura's room. Oh, I lived with Laura. Oh, I remember our conversation there. Okay, 
there's a there's a door. <gasps> there's a the little tea kettle. Oh fuck. There was something flashing over there. I didn't like that. Cleaning this area was a lot of work. It was like pulling teeth, but it felt like a good first step. Like the rest would follow. Oh, that's cute. It's like a possum crochet or a cross stitch with bunnies on him and a porcupine. Oh, it's a, it's a clock. It's an open, open package from vaccine. I let it sit for months. Why? This is Laura's room. Yeah. Took me a long time to finally take this sign down. Oh. Does she have like separation stuff? I understand that. Why is that open? Whoa! Sticky notes everywhere. Sticky notes, they're all from me. Some of these are really passive aggressive. Yourself? I guess that kind of makes sense. What's this? I can't click that. Whatever that is. Ew, I hear meat sounds. I understood I Laura moved out, but it still felt really bad. Okay, I was scared that that was going to be something gross. On the corner. In retrospect, these seem kind of excessive. A little bit. It should become... Am I becoming a hoarder? You. Examine meat. Expose muscle. Breathing slowly. Is this place alive? Made out of meat? I can barely stand to think about it. Yeah, it's fucking gross. Ew! The meat walls are closing in! I really let this place fall apart. Half a pair of scissors. There's some blood on the blade, like somebody cut themselves breaking them apart. No. Don't take that turn. Francis, I'm so glad. Who's Francis? M. I just unloaded all my boxes of books. I gotta give you some of these because this awful reading habit of mine makes moving miserable. It's crazy that I can be doing work and know that within five miles, you're puttering around doing your thing. Congrats on the real actual book you've illustrated, by the way. I know this was always a dream of yours, so proud of you. Look at us, two adults with jobs and apartments in the same city. Come check out my dinky little apartment. I want to see your dinky little apartment. I want to see Laura again. Let's go to, <gasps> let's go to the museum or the movies or get drunk and play pinball. Francine, probably. Growing pile of mail, what a mess. She has, I think she has trouble letting go. Oh, oh snap. Can I not walk past this? Yeah, I can't walk past this anymore. Ew. Whoa, whoa. Okay. And sticky notes are on that side. Some of these are in a handwriting I don't recognize. In fact, they're not even words. Oh. Yo, Solo! Thank you so much for the raid. Hey, how how was Doki Doki? How far did you get? What happened? Fill me in. Also, anyone in my chat, no spoilers for Solo. His, it's his first play of Doki Doki, which I think we played that... I think we played Doki Doki last year for Screamtober? It was last year or the year before. It's a great game. You ended up not playing any at all? Are you serious? What happened? What's going on here? Oh, also, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because you're coming in with a hot, spicy raid, let's do a, let's do a Dixper drop. Yeah? Solo, are you on Dixper? I would give you a, a crate as well directly, but anyone, speed! Whoever claims that first gets a free cake so you can send jump scares and stuff to me on screen. You got distracted? Did you just have a just chatting screen or stream? Didn't even crack into it. Holy crap. Got distracted. Making candy tier list. 
Okay, what was an S tier? It better be Skittles. Skittles and Starburst, S tier. Watching X Men 2000 clips? The one with the. Is that the one with all the leather? That was terrible. Dots? S tier? Oh, man. They get. Uh, they get stuck in my teeth. Stuck in my teeth. Also, Solo, if you if you have a if you do have a Dixper account, let me know and I'll get you a crate directly. What? What's with the input lag? Come on. So we're playing a scary game here, and uh, we're like escaping this nightmare now. I hope. Ew. I still can't observe that. Examine clutter. Wait, what? Oh, God, it's on the other side. Did I really let it get this bad? Yeah, I think I have uh, trouble letting go. And maybe some hoarding tendencies. Go away, bug. Ew. Ew, there's meat everywhere. Go away, bug. Ew, and it makes meat noises when I walk on it. It's turning gray, dying. This place is on its last legs. I suppose that's good though because this place sucks sticky notes everywhere some of these are in my handwriting a lot of them are just scrawled scribbly mess what listen all right i've never banned anyone over their choice of candy but really skittles and starburst were d what's wrong with you what's wrong with you what is this game this game is home buddy if you uh if you are familiar with like the game crumbs it's uh one of the games they i, I think they produced their friend Jordy made it. Oh my god! Ha! There was a face hugger. That scared the shit out of me. Nice person. GG person scared the shit out of me. Examine scratches. So this is all new. I just broke out of the main loop of the game. And now this is all new. This is all different. So no idea what's happening anymore. I claimed it. It's mine, losers. <laughs> Scratches. Is that thing trapped down here? Oh, all the scares. Oh, I can hear myself. Why is it not? Oh, it's been disabled right away. That's why. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the pumper pile. Yay, the cookie. Hello. Yeah, wake up. Also, if you guys don't know me, I'm Vasive. I'm a variety gamer here on Twitch. It is uh, unfortunately screamed over right now, and we have to play scary games. I have a big chicken, and I scream at them, and this is horrible. And there's a vote in the Discord on which scary games I'm going to play this year. So feel free to join the Discord and cast your votes. Let me know what you think. Jada, wake up! Hey! Hey, good morning! But this is the real star of the show. This is Jada. Hey, that cookie. Say thank you for the follow. Welcome to the pupper pile. Oh. Um. Okay, so scratches. Oh, God, is that dust? Oh, it's trash. A bunch of torn up sheets and bandages and paper all torn up and mixed together. There's a homunculus living here. It's kind of pathetic. Examine scratches. That thing, the homunculus just kept banging at the walls trying to get out. This door is shut. No, 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 no. Oh, God, neat hallway. Ah! Fuck. Stop it. Oh, the scissor! It's gonna be me. It didn't try to kill me because I set it free. Oh. Francine's here with me. Emily! Uh, sorry about the mess. I don't think it's this bad in real life. Where'd the homunculus go? has to be looking for us right and kind of just ran away not anymore I saw the door was open made a break for it i don't think it liked being here either things are going wild up, up above you should see it up above i can't go back up there <laughs> thanks for the nose honk why are you waking me up i got work in the morning wait what what happened oh, we can't get go back up there You'd rather take your chances out there? Uh, meat void, dude. Good point. Oh my god, what's happening? Oh! oh. 
attic. A different attic. It's not a wild classical haunted house anymore. It's just a house. <gasps> oh no, those I thought those windows were the same symbols with the actuator or whatever it was. Just a normal house with a normal attic. Yeah, after we you went down the elevator, I kind of lived and died a few more times and did it still kill you? He's really? Yeah, don't worry about it. But every time I came back, it seemed like the house was changing. I got a, it got a little smaller, less colorful, a little sadder. Or like I actually remember it. Let's take a look around, I guess. Knock yourself out. What is happening? Oh my god. I'm watching the sunset over the lake as I write this. Wait, who is this to? Do I need to read this? Oh, this is to the guy that built this place. I don't think I care to read that. These I might, as I'm an artist. Or my character is. Laura, I found these while cleaning, and since I'll be around the post office today, I want to take a moment to send them to you. They're from another time, but somehow I still think of these evil lines in the hands that drew them, Parker. I still don't understand their story, but that could be because I kind of skipped over the stuff because they chased me. This is an old Grubsoft game. Looks scary. Grubsoft. That's great. Oh, Christmas tree. Do I leave now? Talk to you? I guess we're ready to just flip the switch on the accu accumulator. That's the word. Wait, the accumulator. That box over there? Wait, box? Yep. Here's just a normally, totally normal, creepy old pseudoscience box. Well, might as well give it a try. Holy shit. Oh, absolutely check out the, the vote list. I think um, what's currently winning right now is uh, Yomawari Night Alone. Night Alone? I think Night Alone. Make a PowerPoint, but some picks might not comply with the Twitch guidelines. <laughs> Put in the effort. Uh, what happened to the others that I left? What happened to this place? Yeah, I want to know what happened to my other friends. The other kids? They all disappeared. Not long after you went into the elevator, they were just gone. And then the elevator came back up and the monkey list got in and went after you. Creepy. That's when the house started to change. What happened to this place? I have no idea. I mean, I guess I have some idea. You saw it. It was falling apart. It feels like it shed the layers we had put on it. Like it turned back into Ness house as it actually was. Who's Nest? Never really figured out who that person is. They're just there. I mean, they're like the owner of the house, but why? 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 Like, uh, there, there's some pieces that don't quite make sense. Without all the emotional burden we had put on it. Exactly. I guess. By the way, what was the deal with those fleshy little creatures? Yeah, the one that ran? The little jiggly things in Nest House. I only saw it once out of the entire time playing it. I thought they were kind of cute. They were. They were adorable. Same, I guess. Weird little walking kidneys. <laughs> walking kidneys. Wait, no. Now that I put it that way, I hate them. They still remind me of the homunculus. Bipedal flesh lumps kind of going through the motions of human behavior. But those things were adorably dumb. The monculus is scary. But like, baby. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Almost like the monculus had more reference material to pull from. It was this time we had one had gotten in injured and was dragging itself towards me, whimpering and stuff. It started nuzzling against my leg like it wanted me to pet it. So I did. Until it died. Oh, don't tell me that. That's sad. Get some grub. Yes, anyone coming in from the raid, please, you know, get up, stretch. Get some water, get some food. Take your pills if you haven't done it already, if you need to dip out. Because I know you can uh, lose track of time in watching your streamers. If you need to get ready for bed, please do so. Self-care is very important. Uh, So please go take care of yourself if you need to. Uh, That's sad. I think that might have messed me up more than some of the times I watched the, you guys die. Ugh. What did its skin feel like? Like wet velvet. Who would have guessed this whole place was made out of meat? Yeah. I still think it's my brain. Because 
your brain can be a prison, right? And that's made of meat. Definitely not me. Do you think this place has been take making us out of the same stuff? Don't. No, I refuse to en entertain this possibility. What do you think happened to the kids after they disappeared? I guess the same thing that's gonna happen to us. Yikes. Did we ever end up working our shit out? Yes, I'm very interested in that. I don't know. Maybe? I like the thought of it. Me too. I miss you. I miss you too, dummy. Did you ever hash things out with Laura? I don't remember. I hope she found a better roommate, at least. Do you remember anything that happened after all this? I don't. I don't even know what year it is. What do you think happened to Nest? In my heart of hearts, I think I'm kind of charmed by him, in spite of everything. Really? I want to hope he got older and wiser somehow. There's a letter over there from Clara. The tone is like she's a little older and wiser herself. Sounds like N Nest got back in touch with her at some point. She's not replying like he's a pre- Training obnoxious jerk, so I guess he did something right. That's pretty heart heartening. Clara seems genuinely interesting and sweet. I feel weirdly attached to this idea of her. Which might just be Ness's idea of her. Speaking of Ness's ideas, did you read his doofy sci-fi? Oh yeah, very bad. I can see the pamphlet now. Are you at risk for becoming a baby man? <laughs> see anything? See anything interesting? Oh, that's me. See anything interesting in the sky? No, you don't. Go inside. The drawing of it is of, like, an old cigarette ad looking guy with lightning shooting out. Oh, I misclicked. My finger spasmed. And the drawing's bad. And the drawing is really bad. Even if he only had a little time left, I hope this after, after all this, he figured out how to stop being a shut-in. I hope after all this, I figured out how to stop being a shut-in. You're never too old to not, have not figured out any fucking thing out. Whoa. Figured. Start over. You're never too old to have not figured any fucking thing out, I guess. I always thought you had it more figured out than me. Well, I'm glad the elaborate ruse of my entire personality worked. Ready to go. I am too. Okay. Let's get together soon. I'm really going to miss you, Francine. Let's get together soon. That noise! I never figured out what it means, but it's creepy. It was good seeing you. No, it wasn't. Why would you say that? Escape the house redux. Escape the house for the last time. Is it really the last time? Maybe I have a agoraphobia. Is that the one where you're scared of like leaving your house? Okay, I'm gonna have to look up the story. What time is it? Holy crap, perfect timing. Um, homebody story explanation. Spoilers. The game is set in a time loop where every death results in a new piece overall puzzle. Yep, the story brings in themes of isolation, nostalgia, and anxiety our relationships from the past. Okay, I was right about the anxiety. Uh, that didn't help. That was just more information. That was just about the game. I need, I want, I want to know. I want a story explanation. What's up, Yuri? It's classic or love letter. Part contemporary commentary on the struggles of, of anxiety and isolation. The 
seeing the dives deeper into her psyche and backstory help you get attached to the semi-successful artist, it's not long until you actively want to see her survive this nightmare. You will huh. obey. Scared the shit out of me. Story. Here you go. She did sleep and you want to wake her up for a boop? No, let's do a boop just to not fully wake her up. Hey, you didn't want Uncle Cookie sleep? Uncle Cookie? Yeah. Hey, wake up. Hey, wake up. Wake up. Cookie. It's Cookie. Boop. Oh. Oh, Cookie for you. There you go. <laughs> what was your question, Yuri? Or was that your question? We beat home, buddy. Awesome. Um, I'm gonna we're gonna switch to this. I don't know how annoying the the background tone is gonna be. So if it gets annoying, let me know. Cookies can be put in escrow. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna read this story here to see if. I understand what's happening. Buddy follows the introverted Emily as she reconnects with her old friends at a creepy house to watch a meteor shower. Uh-huh. Uh, -huh. uh I, I can't read all this out loud because I could, maybe it's copyrighted or something. Uh yep. Somebody doesn't have much of a main plot. <laughs> you infer a lot of the main story through symbolism and big flashbacks not even a proper explanation at the end um really that wasn't helpful at all that, that wasn't story explanation at all come on story I don't know maybe there is no like story explanation what is the story of the game homebody huh reveal the story okay that didn't help does homebody have multiple endings doesn't it's littered with optional interacts and dialogue options uh-huh i want to know what the <sighs> noise was homebody breathing noise what is causing the faint breathing sound in my house i am not opening that it sounds terrifying Breathing sound in an empty room. Nope. I'm not reading those. I, I don't need freaking hor actual real life scary things. Homebody game breathing noise. Okay, so this person said, um, homebody mentioned uh, agoraphobia as well. Damn it. Oh, this is actually posted by Jory, the guy that made it, or wrote it. Um. Okay. Not much. That that's just them talking about the game. Okay. I don't know. There's there doesn't seem to be anything about the story, kind of thing. The the whole entity like there's a a higher being that's dying that that was strange too and one of the articles i read is that it, it, it suffers from classic they called it like classic indie storytelling where it's very heavily based in symbolism and stuff and you have to infer what you want to infer from it which okay but there was there's like a lot of holes that i don't quite understand but besides some of the puzzles being extremely frustrating but that could be because i'm a dum-dum the game was actually really really well done it was, Eight or nine hours to complete? 
How much shade should I throw at a lender who pissed me off? Every party so far. I'm about to write a scathing email, but I'm trying to be nice while putting grill marks on their ass so they don't do it again. Scathing email? Not a review? I guess it depends on what, how they pissed you off. Because if they did something really fucked up, then yeah, light them up. I guess what I always do in situations like that is I like to think about how much energy is this going to sap from me putting this out there? And then if it comes back to me, that's more energy that is going to get sapped from me. Is it worth it? Kind of thing. That's how I look at it. Like, like uh, an example, driving on the road, someone gets road rage at you and cuts you off and slams on their brake. Now, you can say, okay, you're a dickweed. Fuck off. You just like passively just say this in your brain or whatever. And then you can go about your day 10 minutes or like five minutes after that encounter. You don't see him again. Five minutes, you're, you're back down to normal. Or you can get ragey as well and let it ruin your day or potentially ruin your next few weeks by an accident happening. Because then you have to deal with them more. Then you have to deal with your car being in the shop. Then you got to deal with insurance companies, all that shit. So it really depends on how much energy you're willing to be sapped from you. That, that would be my input. Loan officer doesn't listen, ordered shit before I signed docs. They're messing up my current. Is it a new loan person? Officer got documented with me because their documents were wrong. That's annoying. Now I'm yelling that at the person. <laughs> they were nice people in conversation, but I'd beat them like a rented mule. <laughs> assault wasn't a thing uh, I mean people make mistakes people are all human even if it is your daily job or whatever but I don't know I, I would put it in terms of how much are you willing to how much energy you're willing to put into it I'm not gonna have to deal with them long but they have access to my financial information and I bank with their company <laughs> If they cut me off like that, yeah, I'm gonna insult it for it. Yeah, I do that too, but I don't, I don't escalate it to the point where they're gonna be do something stupid. I like, I got cut off the other day. Some asshole literally turned into me. I had a slam on my brakes, so I honked at him twice. Beep beep, you know. So the motherfucker proceeded to slam on his brakes and brake check me. He cut me off, so he brake checks me because I honk at him. Like a fucking asshole. And at that point, like, we were going to be up next to each other in a stoplight. He's like, fuck that. I'm not dealing with this prick. Because, like, he kept, like, looking at me. I was like, fuck that. And so I just took the right and just pulled a UE and left again. Anyway. No. I could have escalated it by, like, flipping him off and blah, blah, blah. No. Like, All right. You be a piece of shit. Fuck you. I'm on my way home. Hang out with my dog. Eat some dinner play some video games instead of possibly making it worse it's Jaden alright so I said all you're fired this is why have a nice day <laughs> okay I, I need to I need to exit that because it hurt my brain um well heck dudes we, we finished homebody uh, that means... Okay, okay. So, schedule coming up. Um, so, we finished Homebody. Friday, we're still going to continue playing Baldur's Gate 3 with Lee. Really, 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 really excited for that. I'm bummed that we knocked out Wednesday, but I figured you guys want to get your Screamtober stuff in. Uh, but I still want to play Baldur's Gate. I didn't want to push it off um, this month. And I was like, yeah, well, you can play on the weekend. But then that's five days of stream and... That can get exhausting, and I didn't want to commit to myself to doing that because if I try to do five days of stream, then I'd be like, I'm gonna end up being tired on like a Monday or something. Then I'd take time off from Screamtober, so screw it. We'll just do Fridays and stuff, and keep the normal schedule. So we're gonna continue playing that on uh, next week. 
a plan is to play your Mawari Knight alone. Um, I'll, actually, depends on the, the Discord. Uh, new votes have maybe come in for that. But um, as it said, you know, an hour ago, Yoma Wari, as far as I knew, was winning still. So um, if these people get a hair up their ass and mess up on my deal, there's nightmare and losses. So I don't let me. <laughs> so I'm going to try to be restrained. There you go. That's what you put it up to. Like, all right, well, if you guys really fuck it up, then it goes to like a court thing, which saps my energy. But then that's someone else's thing that they deal with it. I don't have to deal with it by something that was my action. Also, it feels like my, my green screen got worse. Look at you can actually see the outline of the green now. That's new. That hasn't been like that for a long time. I wonder if it, it's because snap cam is enabled. And I might not have the same filters on. All right, I might have to change that. Because uh, I, haven't ha I haven't been using Snapcam in forever because it was causing all sorts of issues. But my computer, knock on wood, has been acting better, which is great. Except for the input lag. I, I have no idea what causes that. It drives me nuts. Actually, you know what? I'm going to check something. I did find a few weeks ago that freaking Windows kept changing my... um. My refresh rate for some stinking reason. Hold on a minute. Uh, I don't care about scaling settings. Oh, this one. This monitor. I don't remember where it's at. Fuck. Advanced display. There it is. Nope. Refresh rate is still fine. Don't know. Thanks for the feedback. <laughs> no problem. Coming to visit once you get settled. Yeah, dude. Hopefully it goes through. Like, um, did the um uh the inspection go well? Did you guys put any things for them to fix? As long as she's okay with cats? I don't think she would care. Uh maybe. I don't know. Every cat that she's seen has like run from her, so I she she might think that um she's someone to chase. There's something to chase, but she's old. But she still does try to catch rabbits. I don't know. But I'm horribly allergic to cats, so... <laughs> could be a thing. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. I stepped in a water puddle with my socks on. Oh! That... I totally understand. That is awful. Wet socks is one of the worst feelings in the world. Followed swiftly by... Anything in between my toes. So like if a sock gets in between my toes. <laughs> no, thank you. No, thank you. Inspection was today. I was told about the issues. I'm comfortable solving most of them. But new roof is bombing me. Hey, that's what I did with my house. Uh, I think my the house was 10 years old at the time or something. And then the inspection showed some damage. And I was like, hey, fix the roof. And they did. So that worked. But yeah. The, the, the other one, and I, I had him fix, like, some of the minor things that I didn't want to deal with. It was, like, the, sli the, sli the screen door or something didn't slide properly. Whatever. And they, they fixed those. Um, but, yeah, definitely, if you can, if you can get a, a roof out of it, do it. Excuse me. There was nothing... Well, I'm assuming you guys, since you're go <gasps> still going through with it, there was nothing super horrible about it to keep you guys or to withdraw your your offer right tell being where i just put it in the freezer i thought about doing that but then i would get like used to always like i love cold pillows i need them I, that's why i have so many because they get hot through the night so i flip them over and switch I got a thing to help like cool my bed and there's Things to help, like, cool your pillows that you can hook up to it, too, similar to the bed one, but then it's, like, locked the cables and stuff, and you can't move. And, and I sleep weird. Sometimes I, like, I sleep, like, holding the pillow like this, and then my head rests on it, you know? It's like, there's no way I could use one of those. But, like, the only time I sleep, I sleep well because I sleep horrible, um is when it's winter and I keep the window open and I suck in all the cold air and all my pillows stay frozen. That's the only time I actually feel like I sleep better 
because it's like, oh, yes, cold. <sighs> Love cold pillows. I'm forced to buy as is. I can maybe get some off, but don't know. Appraisal is what's going to do a lot of it. Appraisal is what determines the financing. So if it's way off, it doesn't matter if we love it unless we want to lose a lot of cash. Yes. Wait. Don't they mine? Um, maybe it just taken a while. My inspection and appraisal was done at the same time. I'm assuming your guys' was too, and you're just waiting for the repairs to come back, maybe? Eight sleep pillow top? Eight sleep pillow top. Is it a mattress? It's a pillow. Intelligent cooling and heating. Ew. No, stop with the ads. Description. Carbon infused foam meets a propriety phase bait change. Material to absorb and dissipate heat away from the body. It's air ventilation system in case in high quality tensile mesh cover increases airflow and breathability. How how firm is it? I don't like firm pillows. My, <laughs> the pillows I like the most are the ones that I've had for years that are just like have a hole in the middle and you just can scrunch them up. I don't know why. Sleep essentials bundle. Why am I looking at sleep and stuff? Or pillows and sheets. <laughs> Is it a good pillow though? Two pack. Oh, I should just get a portable freezer for my bedroom. And then just fill it like one, one of the, the freezers that are like the mini fridges that people have in garages. I should just get one of those. Put it in my bedroom and just fill it with all my pillows right before bed. That sounds like genius. All right. Eight sleep pillow top. I'll, I'll have to think about that. Check out the pillow top for your sleep. Your appraisal has been done by a completely separate neutral entity. A bunch of other stuff. VA product. Okay. Oh, you were talking about the pillow top, the, like, mattress. Is it like a mattress protector? The whole bed got you. It's not blowing air across you. It cools the space you lay on. Trust me, it feels so much better because I hate having air blow on me when I'm asleep. How cool, though. Like, I like my bed cold. Like, I've gotten some... They, relatively expensive like sheets and stuff they're like no oh, heat we can blah, keep you cool they stay cool in terms of like they don't warm you up but they don't make it cold because i like cold i want it cold i want it you know okay so you know when you go camping that's the other time i can sleep is because it's so fucking cold in the mountains right and no, where you're not laying is really fucking cold. And I love that. So I, that's why I bring like extra like blankets and stuff around me. Because then my sleeping bag, I get hot. So I just reach over and I grab another blanket. And I'm like, oh, lay on that side because it's cold. You know? If I could just sleep like that all the time, it would be great. Where their actual mattresses are crap at the top that goes on your comfy match mattress. But I mean, that's it. I do need a new bed. Mine is old. Mine is at oh my god, mine might my bed might be 15 years old. Given I've put like foam mattress tops on top of it, which are garbage. Yeah, I've been thinking about replacing my bed forever, but they're like three thousand dollars. What the fuck? So much money. And a lot of people are like, oh, you spend like a third of your life asleep. I know, but I'm asleep, so I don't like enjoy I I don't it's like it's like paying bill. It's like, okay, cool, yeah, I got a function out of spending money when but I don't get anything enjoyable out of the spending money. It feels like a bill. That's what it is. That buying a mattress feels like a bill. 
you know? Sarah lays down warm, wakes up cold. I lay down cold, wake up warm. Thing also vibrates as an alarm. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I, I am a, I'm a furnace, so I hate it. And it is still warm, but she sleeps at the foot of the bed. But when mom is around, she liked to cuddle. And oh my God, it was so hot. Like if I had a, I had a partner, they'd be like, oh, you're warm. And they'd, they'd snuggle up. It was like, oh, I'm dying. Here, take mama's. She'll keep you warm. I need to scooch to the edge to get away from all the heat. <laughs> Basically, sleep on a comfy blanket as I was sleeping as 68F from naked, and that's not max temp. Dude, like, I sleep with, like, a heated, or not a heated blanket, uh, a weighted blanket. That's about it. <laughs> a few years ago, my bedroom got below freezing point because I was pulling in all the air, and it was snowing. And I was like, ooh, it's chilly in here. And I went to my bathroom, and there was a cup with some water in it. And it had a thin layer of ice at the top. Like, mm, it's cold in here. So I, my, my little alarm can measure temperature. I asked it what temperature it was. And it was like, it is currently 28 degrees. So, ooh, it's cold in here. I loved it. Loved it. So, yeah. I would that That's just, yeah. I wish it was like that all the time. Even my, my cover thing that it, you, it pumps water through coils and stuff in the, the topper and cools it down. It works to an extent, but some nights I swear it doesn't work. And then like two nights ago, I was like, oh, cool. Like, I can feel the, the cool area. I'm going to roll into it. And other nights it's just like, I, the whole thing is warm still. I don't understand. It's a bummer. I'm in Mon Station. I need to step out because Sarah's going to sleep. What time? Oh, yeah, it's late for you guys. Oh, my God. I need to end stream, too. Because I'm almost at normal stream. I'm taking... Why am I wearing this thing? I need to take this thing off. It's making me itch. I don't need to wear that anymore. Yeah, da. Booby. All right. Well, that was great fun. Uh, Me. Let me. This button. There it is. Uh-oh, might not be muted. Mute. Self-mute. Ha-ha. Self-mute. All right. Let's see. Who's, who's stream shramming? Today's Wednesday. All right. What do we got? What do we got? Lee's playing games. Oh! Lee's playing, uh... The community challenge game. The community reward. Yo! I think we go Raid Lee. Hell yeah, dude. Um, so he's playing... Uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Explorers of Sky. I have no idea what that is. It's a Pokemon game, obviously. But um, it was a community channel point redemption thing that uh, we all funded. So, let's go Raid Lee. So you guys know how this works. Um, get your... Uh, if you are a sub, feel free to grab the sub message. If you're not, feel free to grab the other message conveniently made for you, or feel free to use any other emotes that you have available to you. Let's go, uh, Raid Lee. Super awesome dude. Uh, he, I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3 with him. Love him as a content creator. Let's go give him some love. But uh, in the meantime, remember to spay new to your pets. Or pens. Spay new to your pets. Adopt, don't shop. Donate to a rescue if you can afford it. Or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out. They're very much in need. Anyways, I am Vasive. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me tonight. Thank you so much for letting me be your streamer tonight. I heavily appreciate it. And I'll catch you all next time. See ya. Daddy, you hungry? Daddy, you hungry? Let's get some foodies. <laughs>